Hi everyone, my name is Serba and welcome to my YouTube channel. My journey started from Istanbul. I fly to one city and took a minibus to the city of Iran. If you have not visited Iran before like me, you probably know and think about Iran as far to us till now. What you think about Iran will change absolutely after watching this video. I was thinking Iran is a very sick country with under control of soldiers and police officers as well not safe for other nationalities and thinking that people are not open-minded enough to other opinions and beliefs. Let's look at 4 big cities of Iran there is unsafe to or not. Firstly, let's go to the capital city Tehran and then to the others. If your currency is built on dollar or euro or something like that, you may feel yourself rich in Iran. As soon as you enter the country from border, even inside the custom state, you may see men exchanging your money with less rates. Be careful and prefer exchange offices. Since in Iran, Visa and Mastercard are out of use, you will need cash there, and thus you will have many banknotes on your hands. So try to exchange little by little. By the way, you can search prepaid debit cards in Iran before visiting as an alternative. You may open an online account, transfer money to that account from your existing bank account or Visa MasterCard and use your Iranian debit card. Iran's official currency is real, but people use the term Toman in the real life, ignoring the zero of the amount. After exchanging money, your another need will be to get a local SIM card with internet. I bought one month internet pocket of Iran cell with very affordable price and was satisfied enough. You can find a branch of them everywhere easily. Because of cheap fuel in Iran, transportation is very cheap, even you can take a taxi from one city to another. But especially yellow taxis are trying to get much more than normal price, so again be careful. In Iran, people use Synap application inside the city. It's pretty economic and works like Uber system and has English language support. I strongly recommend you to download and sign up as soon as after you get the local SIM card. Iran is very fascinating with its history, nature of beauties and touristic places.
Now two jump to clear, also known as shaft clear or emerald clear, is one of the most amazing and largest clear in the world. Situated at the center of the farm with a very nice landscape. There are traditional bazaars all around it, an ancient mirth and a palace. Nakshi Jam Square is accepted as one of UNESCO's World Heritage Sites with approximately 160 meters wide by 560 meters long. At the end of our day trip, we were very happy to be there. You see many motorcycles because it's a special day to celebrate in memory of Imam Zaman. But nevertheless, you can see quite much motorcycles in Iran, especially in Tehran. I saw many. It's a culture there, and you can see three or four people on a motorcycle with comfort. And I cannot find any words to describe how friendly and hospitable Iranian people are. Okay, your turn. Anne, Hafeze, Seni, Seviro.
I am now going to Shiraz city. I feel that hospitality is a culture of Iran everywhere. We can see different types of services in airplanes like this in Tabriz Tehran airport. But first time I see food service at the bus in my life. Also they serve chicken with rice in my another bus journey in Iran. It is impossible to tell about Iran kitchen in a few minutes here. It's a topic of another time, but I can say that rice with sofran is popular at home or outside. Fried chicken is quite popular outside and also ice cream for sure. And instead of sugar cubes, they have stick candy most of the time. And now it's time to go to the start point. Years ago, Persepolis was the capital city of Persian Empire. I'm not expert to tell the story behind these historical arts, but you feel like at that time here. Let me mention about some other experiences and opinions of mine in general while exploring these great monuments. I need to state that Iranian people care their health quite much. For sure there may be a little use of alcohol or illegal drugs, but mainly it's not common. Of course we need to take into account the impact of the regime. Smoking rate is also very little. I only saw a very small amount of people smoking in the streets. Shaking hands of couples is seen really has kept is a must even if you are a tourist. Iranian women care their beauty and they are always well groomed with attractive makeup and style. Iranian people share their traditions and have family respects. For sure the young are coming together in parties and enjoying their time. Maybe because of the regime they don't prefer to talk about politics, they are positive, happy and friendly. In Tabriz it was very easy for me to communicate without even using one word in English. We could understand each other in Turkish, but in Tehran no Turkish speaking people and very rarely English speaking people I saw. One of the most interesting things I faced was that Iranian people tell the password of their bank cards to the salesperson when they are shopping they do not press the numbers. For your stay you may choose hotel or hostel but keep in mind that Iranian people are very hospitable and they are often close to you in couch surfing. And note that in Iran some applications are not used due to the restrictions so you will need to use the VPN program for your phone. Thank you so much for watching my video and if you enjoyed please like and share as much as possible and also to be informed for my next video you can subscribe here and you can join my Instagram account.